exclusive live radar, your three-minute advantage, so you'll know first. This is WVTM 13 Live Doppler. A beautiful spring-like day today with lots of sunshine, temperatures in the low 80s, near record values. We've started to see some clouds increase from the west. It's going to make for a really nice sunset, I think, here over the next 30 to 40 minutes or so. Temperatures still holding on to the upper 70s in most locations. 77 in Tuscaloosa, 79 Birmingham. How about 80 in Alabaster? 79 degrees in Anniston. Through the evening hours, not bad at all. Pretty mild this evening, partly cloudy sky, 64 at 9, down to 59 shortly after midnight. First thing tomorrow morning, temperatures near 50. We'll see a good deal of sunshine again for our Saturday, just like today. Those high temperatures climbing up close to 80 degrees, some low 80s possible. There's a look at our high resolution forecast model indicating partly cloudy skies for our Saturday afternoon. Increasing south winds turning a little more muggy on Sunday, but still a pretty nice day, partly cloudy and highs again in the low 80s. Changes though heading our way, especially once we get into Monday. You can see by Monday morning increasing clouds and showers back up to our northwest. It's an organizing cold front and that cold front will move our way and that's going to bring rain chances into the forecast. Before then, though, again, just enjoy that weekend weather if you possibly can, both Saturday and Sunday, looking like great outdoor weather days, highs both days in the low 80s with a mix of sun and clouds in that forecast. Here we go for Monday. You can see the rain back off to our west. That cold front moves in, showers and thunderstorms increasing, especially for the afternoon and evening hours. We'll watch closely because there's potential with wind shear and instability in place that a couple of storms could briefly become severe during the afternoon and evening hours Monday. That front moves down to the south. We temporarily dry out first thing Tuesday, but then it lifts back north, bringing more rain, more showers, maybe a few rumbles of thunder back to the forecast late Tuesday and into Wednesday. So you get the picture more unsubbed weather, certainly heading our way next week after a stretch of beautiful weather days that we had this week. So here's the potential for the possibility of isolated severe weather Tuesday afternoon and evening, especially it looks like areas north of I-20. That's what we'll be watching really closely. The potential for all modes of severe weather. Over the weekend, a mix of sun and clouds, very warm. That impact weather for Monday with showers and a few thunderstorms. Showers back in the forecast late Tuesday, lasting through our Wednesday. It will also turn cooler next week with highs generally running in the low to mid 60s. You're watching WVTM 13 News.